it was uh, just a regular day. Me and Caleb were on the roof. One of my workers noticed the smoke. We started hearing screams from kids, um, especially a girl, loud, very loud screams. As soon as we heard that, I told my guys to go run over there. By the time we got to the scene here, the house was already engulfed in flames. We started seeing them, people coming out. The dad was trying to break it with a broom, which wasn't doing the job. I grabbed the hatch and I smashed the rest of the window and then uh, we told him to jump through, so we pulled him out and by the time he got out, there was burns on his feet and everything else. It was a very close call for sure, getting them out of that small window. That's where uh, the window was and that's where we smashed, smashed the window and uh, got them out. There wasn't really any thinking at that point in time for our safety. Um, we were just trying to get those children and whoever else was there out safely. We were very uh, proud, especially because of all the people that were coming up to us, um, telling us we were heroes. We, we really appreciate that, hearing those kind words. As my father was doing roofing for 25 years, I know he would do the same thing, and I know he's proud. He passed away this last month here, and so I'm, I'm very proud I was able to be there. And, and I'm really proud of my guys with what they were able to do, the reactors like that. Um, in those, those times, seconds mean so much. Yeah, I'm sure your father would have been really proud. And thank goodness those roofers by chance were staying late that night.